DVRP is the Disaster Vulnerability Reduction Project. For close to a decade, its mandate has been to strengthen St. Lucia's resilience to climate change. The delegation of the World Bank and the EU toured the island with the purpose of visiting key ongoing construction activities of the DVRP. These activities included construction of the Venus Ansley Road, the Piai Bridge, Miku Secondary School, Bexor Community Centre, Piai Community Centre and the Roblo Community Centre. And the DVRP has been implemented to close to 10 years and at this stage this is our last uh, implementation support mission and obviously this is an emotional moment for all of us now from the government perspective and also from the bank because I think that this project really achieved a lot throughout uh, the previous years of implementation really from roads to um, intervening in bridges, community centers, schools um, so the list is, is really quite impressive. Two of the projects are funded by the DVRP through its EU funding envelope. These two are the construction of the Piai Bridge and the Venus Ansley Road. The 12-kilometer road was damaged by previous storms. It provided an alternative route between the communities of Millet and Ansley for motorists, residents and agriculturalists. The delegation also visited the site of the Miku Secondary School's smart block. The smart block is one of many other activities facilitated by the DVRP. The smart block is a two-story structure of reinforced concrete inclusive of a concrete roof. It boasts five general classrooms and several specialty classrooms. Look, this is really impressive and it's amazing the type of work that the project uh, uh, coordination unit is doing together with the uh, consultant and, and uh, contractors. And despite many challenges throughout the uh, previous uh, few years, no? if you think about the uh, uh, COVID pandemic, if you think about supply chain issues, if you think about weather conditions, if you think about so many challenges that kind of made it more difficult to implement the activities throughout the uh, previous years. But we come here this week and we see very impressive progress. The DVRP was called into action in 2014 through a collaboration between the World Bank Group and the government of St. Lucia. This is Jack Hingson Compton of the Disaster Vulnerability Reduction Project. Thank you.